you a part of a now or then legacy? Now, this is a bit of a deeper, meaningful question that I'm asking you. And I'm asking you this because of the fact that I've dealt with many organizations who've dealt with a lot of change. And when change happens, we have trauma, we've got grief, and all of the other attachments that go with change. So, when we're talking about legacy building as well, we can really hold on to the past as it was the best thing ever. However, the future is really exciting as well. And while we're holding on to the past legacy issues, it doesn't allow us to move on. So, my question to you is, are you a part of the now legacy or the then legacy? There's a real differentiation with it. If you've been through change within your workplace, have a look around. This week, have the lens of, are you in the now legacy or the then legacy? Let me know how you go. It's an interesting one.